So we would have got here this morning around oh, 9 o'clock, even though we had anticipated it to be around 7. But did, did you meet anyone here when you got here? Actually, when we got here, there were three sets of groups, one from Chagonas, one from Freeport, and another family from Kelly. They were waiting. I would think right now, well, um, we got up here, as, as I told you, just about after 9, 10, yeah. and it's now after 2 in the evening, and I would say we have probably between 150 to 200 persons here, but I still believe it will build up. One thing I must say, I don't consider it a deterrent, because as you know, the Commissioner of Police, Gary Griffin, have a job to do. So, I don't know if you've met police on the way upcoming. Actually, we did not. Okay, but this morning, there were police patrols, around 15 police, they had a little roadblock, not to deter people from coming, but in order to check vehicles for their roadworthiness, people had their license, tires were fine and so on. Bricks. I think I don't feel like yeah, this, uh, this first day out here from the Martin side, we just come to enjoy the seven quarter river. We haven't been here in months. We just come up with a little excitement, enjoy yourself and not too much drink, drinking, social distancing and try it. Hello, why not a curry? Well, we're from the so we're not accustomed to curry too much, so, you know? You're gonna do it, Yeah. Come, right. come, 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 we want to see that one. Alright. It's a local website, Pela, they call it chicken, peas, carrots, all the local ingredients. Very dry. Alright, guys, so even more than the beach, it would seem that Coral River is the place to be, at least right now, in terms of the line. Of course, it's just day one, so we have the rest of the week and perhaps even by the weekend rope. to see what happens and which spots are going uh -huh. to be populated. They're very deep in Reporting yeah, from I know Coral that. River Pool 1, I am Alicia Boucher for TV6 News. Thanks, Alicia. Hope you got